Gear Week was over, but not quite yet. We've been invited to Shankill Castle in Paulstown in Kilkenny, where they're going to take us on Scarefest. So you're all very welcome to Shankill. Uh, Shankill means old church in Irish, and there is an old church outside in the woods here. Peter Aylmer is the ghost of Shankill Castle. So the reason Peter is a ghost is because when he died, he died quite an old man. Um, his body was stolen from his grave. Mm -hmm. So there's a family vault outside in the church. A vault is an underground tomb where bodies are kept. And um, his body was stolen from there. And ever since, he has haunted the corridor outside his bedroom upstairs and the staircase. This is freaking me out. This is, this is really, really, really making me uneasy. And so when we first moved here, my mum and dad just thought that this would be their room. Um, so they tried it out for about two weeks and um, they didn't like it. They had a strange feeling when they slept in this room. So Trish, this is the first time in all of Scare Week that you've had to leave. It's okay, it's okay. I know sometimes. So best of luck guys. Hope to see some of you at least afterwards. Okay. Oh my god. Oh sweet god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What are we doing? Why are we going in this? We follow Jack into this? Oh, I think so. He doesn't move. So Trish, this is the end of Scare Week officially. The end of Scare Week, which means my heart will be back to normal once and for all. It has been very exciting, thrilling. I've been sufficiently scared, but it's been a really, really good experience. I've learned a whole lot about ghosts and... Shankill Castle has been amazing. probably one of the scariest places we've done. In terms of getting frights, it's just been pretty amazing. I think it's it's the darkness, the cold. The actors and that kind of yeah, thing, that, that it kind of adds to it. added to it. But I think even without all that, you still do get, there's a feeling of something here. Yeah. You know, something other than yourself, something of the paranormal.